In this video, I'm going to break down some of our favorite YouTube ad spy tools that you can use in 2023 to inspire creativity and help you get the edge over your competition. You may find yourself asking some of these questions. What is the perfect YouTube ad script for my specific product? What can I use from a creative standpoint with my product, how can I package it the proper way that's gonna help me increase my sales? And you realize there are already competitors, right, in your niche that are already doing YouTube ads, Facebook ads, TikTok ads, video ads specifically on these platforms, and you are failing to maybe keep up with a specific trend, or you're really not there where you wanna be yet. So this is where these tools come in they can actually help you get an idea of what is the market reacting to? How is your competitor advertising to your target audience? So we're gonna break down a couple of these spy tools that we're currently using for our clients and for our different offers. So that way you can also leverage them because it's more than just going to your competitor website and you know seeing how they're structuring their offer. I wanted to throw this disclaimer out there. This is not for you to copy your competition, but rather get inspiration from to in order to creatively come up with your own ideas to let's say overcome certain obstacles with you know your ads not converting well why are they not converting well oh maybe you missed a specific angle that will work with your target audience or the different creative angles or the different way of editing your videos needs to be a little better right so these are the different things that you want to look for when using some of these tools so let's get right into it okay number one it's called my ad finder now i want to clarify this is not a tool specifically for youtube this is mainly for facebook advertising and it's really cool because it is free first of all so i know we all like to get these free tools at first to try them out most of these tools do come with a, a free membership right so it's a freemium and then they offer a premium with different characteristics and new features Features that you can use right but with this tool as you can see in my screen here so my ad finder this is the tool right here you can see they have this website it's actually a chrome extension which i'm going to go to in a second so according to them it's the best best extension to spy on your competitors it auto collects and save ads on your facebook newsfeed right so again this is a facebook spy tool but the reason i'm including it in here is because i know for a fact that most advertisers who are already doing ads on facebook they're running ads there they sometimes use the same videos that they're using on YouTube and you can actually get some inspiration from there from there as well right so this is why I'm, I'm starting out with this one not necessarily is the best one per se but it's completely free to start and two it's automated you don't really have to go out your way if you are already looking for let's say creative um, inspiration it does collect on the ads based on your interest obviously so that's one thing that's maybe not the most specific right so you can't really go out and, and, and filter these but you could actually go and use this tool to get an idea of you know the ads that you're getting what other advertisers are are doing online specifically so let me show you by clicking here so this is the Chrome extension it's called my ad finder and then I'm gonna go to collected ads so notice it said it's, it found seven ads so he, here are the ads that I have found for me recently right so these are all the Facebook ads it actually shows the engagement it shows you know the actual image here you could actually play you can actually play the ad as well and this is one in particular ad for example by Leeds Gorilla that they're actually showing on YouTube so the exact same ad they just kind of formatted it based on the platform uh, but this is a cool tool like I said this is automated for me uh, I didn't have to go out and look for this and, and you know as you can see it's it's related to leads and advertising so you know depending on what you have in your settings what your interest is what you're clicking on that's where you get the ad so not necessarily the best way to specifically find your competition but if you know your competitors websites for example you can go to their funnels you know go through as a user essentially and you will be able to uh, access kind of similar to the Facebook ad library you will be able to get those remarketing ads delivered to you and it'll be saved here right so this is just kind of like a, a more automated way of doing things but not necessarily the best tool to, to use for YouTube ads but it just gives you an idea 
of what's out there. Hey, really quickly, if you are somebody that's looking to get into YouTube ads, whether you want to do it yourself or you want it completely done for you, what I recommend is that you go down to the description of this video and click on the top link. What that will allow you to do is book a free strategy session with somebody on our team where we will sit down with you completely for free and see if YouTube ads make sense for your business. And with that, let's jump back into the video. Okay, now the next one is VidTao, right? So we've talked about this before in previous videos, and it is a tool that has come out more or less 2020, 2021, where they have a little bit more, let's say, popularity. It's still being used today, though. They changed a few things, which I'll go over in a second, but you can see here on the website, their, their main thing is YouTube ads made easy, right? So it's a free YouTube ad library. You can just, it says discover and track your market's best YouTube ads. So you can sign up for free. It'll take you to a page like this, right? So notice that you do have free access remaining. This was actually, this is something that's relatively new. I know before when I used this tool, it didn't have this, but you can specifically search for anything. So depending on what your offer is, right? So if you have, let's say an offer in um, Amazon FBA, you can search here and you will be able to get ads related to Amazon FBA. Here's a few ads. Uh, now, one of the cool things about this tool is that you, it does show you the view count for the videos. It shows you the length and also the channel where it's coming from, right? So like, for example, this is an ad. Let's take a look at the one with the most video uh, view count right now. Let me just filter. Here we go. So, so this is an Amazon FBA training. You know, the title says, check out my awesome Volkswagen. So uh, this was from 2019, but you can see the view count on this is 22 million. So maybe this ad has stopped working by now, but you could even see the ad on the left hand side here. So there it is. So, you know, this is nine university reviews, their Amazon FBA training, it seems like. And it's a, it's a six minute video. Now you can see the views when it was first rolled out. I think it takes you back to 2021 here. And then you can see the amount of views that it's getting. It's still, even today, like it has already gotten to 22 million views, right? Even though like the ad spend, it seems that they've spent quite a bit on this. This is not 100% accurate, it's just an estimate, but it's just based off, you know, the CPMs, you know, kind of cost per view. So there it goes, it says uh, a five cents cost per view rate, basically, and it's an assumed rate. But it's really cool because it also gives you the video script, right, for these videos. So, uh, and you can add that to kind of your swipe file, right? Label it Amazon FBA and you save it and now you have that in your collection. So this is a very cool tool that you can use. You can also see the top advertisers here, you know, not necessarily go specifically on the competition, but you can literally take any topic, right? Depending on what your offer is. This is Vidtel. That is one of the tools that is a game changer when it comes to swiping your comp competition and, and taking a look at what they're doing to really get inspiration from again. Okay, the next one that we have is Video Ad Vault. So this is a tool created by TubeSift, which is a tool that helps you with targeting for YouTube ads. So they actually came out with Video Ad Vault a couple years ago, and you know we've been using it ever since. So again, very uh, similar to Video Vault, but you can have get a little bit more specific. All right, so like let's try Tony Robbins for example. So there you go. So you you have like Tony Robbins, a whole bunch of ads here. Ad number three, investment mastery. So the cool thing about this is that you can actually get the the link of the actual funnel where they're sending traffic to, right? So like this is one example, and you know you can do this with all of the ads that are showing up here. You can sort this by views, so you can sort this by views and you can see when this ad was last seen, for example. So if you want to get like more relevant ad, it looks like this one has, the, you know, these, these guys had a nice little spike user. So they're spending good money on YouTube to advertise their, whatever this is, their offer. So this is, again, one of the coolest ones to use. You can also add the video ad URLs in here, right? If you have a, a, an existing list from your TubeSift bookmarker, right? So with TubeSift bookmarker, you can actually add it as a Chrome extension. So you can literally click here and it'll be here. So I already have it. And what it does, you can actually see which ads had you've seen, for example, right? So this is the ad history. So this is a very cool tool that will show you, you know, all the ads that you've been served. And if any of these have any relevance, then you can just bookmark it and then you will be able to add it to your bookmark. So it's a very cool tool that you can use to essentially all of the ads that you're being served online, you can kind of keep a collection on those, or you can simply 
like I said, just continue with this option here, which is a little bit more specific, right? So if you need uh, investment advisor, right? So investment advisor, just throwing different examples here, right? You can see what people are doing for this particular type of offer, right? Invest in commercial properties, right? So, you know, there, there's a whole bunch of relevant ads in here and you can just mess around with, with the settings. You want just the United States? Let's just do United States for this investment advisor type of ad. And you can see these are the only the ads that are served in the US. Some of these have other countries because they're serving there as well. But uh, that is pretty amazing that you can do this and, and you'll be able to gleam from this what it, what are people doing right now? What are other advertiser, other big brands are doing right now in your specific niche and how you can basically surpass what they're doing, right? Or, or do it better, not necessarily copy, but just do it better and, and get lean creativity from them. Okay, guys, and then another spy tool that we use often is called Similar Web. Now, this one is not specific to video ads themselves, but you will be able to analyze your competition. So if you know that there's a specific funnel URL, right, or website that your users, your target audience is visiting specifically, you can get some ideas by typing it in here, right? So I'm just doing this example, typing this in like for the investment mastery. And here you'll be able to get particular information about who's visiting. So you can see it has over 14,000 visits or November and December had less visits. November had this amount. The demographic, it looks like in the, it's in Germany. It's based out of Germany. It does have a .de in there. So this is the demographic that's mainly built out of. And more importantly, you'll be able to see similar sites to this, right? Which you, you can use to create custom intent audiences within Google ads, right? We do have a video where you can learn about the custom segments since, you know, you, obviously Google has been getting rid of different settings such as contextual targeting, not being able to do keywords, specifically topics or placements, but you can do custom intent audiences based off or custom affinity audiences rather based off the URL. So this is where you can glean a, a lot of information. You can also even compare it, right? You can compare it to, to this site or even to your site if you've been running traffic for some time you can also use those tools similar web highly recommended it has a lot of data it's free you can use all this information but if you want more then it does give you other features if you want to upgrade your membership right so you have like digital marketing intelligence okay now uh, this is more like seo related type of features it does have sales intelligence says source new leads across 100 million websites so if you want to use this more like a lead sourcing tool that is something that you can use right but it does give you the basic things like uh, top websites. It does give you all these free tools that you can use to get an idea of what your competition is doing and, you know, get similar competitors and create audiences based off of that. So that is similar web. Okay. And then the last tool that we don't have access to, but we have used it in the past and it's being used right now by many, many affiliates. It's called power ad spy, right? So power ad spy, is a tool built by affiliates for affiliates and it does have a zero dollars meaning a free tool okay so you could actually sign up for free and it gives you 100 searches it says you can find a thousand ads so it has the free version and then from there you have you know from basic all the way to palladium right so uh, they have the premium platinum titanium palladium and, and these are obviously increased in cost as you go along right so like this one's obviously a free trial it does give you like all of the tools all of the specific features that makes this tool a very effective tool specifically for affiliates here's a free plan says no credit card required you can try for five days for free this tool uh, we haven't used it lately you know this is mainly built for like i said for affiliate marketers out there who want to find what other affiliates are doing right spy on other affiliate offers find other ads but this is a this is one of the tools that you can use so that is it guys these are our favorite spy tools for youtube ads that you guys can use again a lot of these are free to use some of those have paid memberships or an up, you can have an upgrade 
for more features but all in all the main premise of these tools is to help you get an idea of what your competitors are doing with youtube advertising right how are they scripting how are they pack packaging their offer you know what is it that their angle what is the winning angle for them right the ads with the most views is most likely an ad that's working that is one thing that you can glean from these tools remember it's not necessary to copy exactly what they're doing the idea is to get inspiration to create ads that will convert ads that you can put to the test with media buying experiments that you can use and and see which one gets you the better results so there you have it guys thank you for watching this video i hope you you enjoyed it don't forget to like comment subscribe turn on your notifications to get notified when we drop some more youtube ad knowledge as well as video advertising knowledge your way thanks again